as much as I love this dollar store, it might be over for them. Sunshade Guard for caps. I was tricked. I thought the cap was included. <laughs> I've been falling for that recently. I need to remind myself accessories not included, but I thought it was the whole setup. It's just the little curtain <laughs> in the back of your neck. Have you ever been on vacation or anywhere hot and you've been outside mowing the yard? Most people do that. <laughs> Hiking, walking the dog, flea markets, a cruise. <laughs> Outside, exposed to the sun for hours. The back of your neck, if it's exposed, that's the worst. They thought of that and they're like, we got you. No more crispy bags. <laughs> <laughs> and I think it'll work for either hats or visors. <laughs> it kind of defeats the purpose because the visor at the top of your head, if you can flip it over <laughs> like a curtain. <laughs> Here's the bonus feature. They put a little secret pocket in it so that you can put a gel pack in it and really stay cold. So it's not just to block the sun, it's to keep you cool. Isn't that heavy though? I didn't have a full gel pack. This is for my eyes. See, it smells like chicken. I hate these things once you put them in the freezer. It's gray, but your picture shows it in black. I wanted it black so it matches. Why am I pissed all the way around? Your picture kind of looks like the gel pack is huge. It, it's not. Look at this little bitty gel pack. How am I gonna fit this in there? <laughs> How am I gonna walk around with that? What are people gonna think? Y'all need to retake photos for the packaging. Okay, boom. It's too heavy, isn't it? That's what it looks like from the inside. It's already sweaty. Now, with the weight of the gel pack, is it gonna work? Could you imagine how embarrassing? You're walking around in your fucking curtain. <laughs> People are gonna have secondhand embarrassment for you. Look at that. <laughs> Lord, tell me the truth when I turn around. Am I gonna look dumb? I guess it doesn't matter because my back's not crispy. How does it look? Is that sexy? I think if you clip it on really good, it, they're gonna stay. Let's see. You're jogging. Congratulations for jogging. Now you're just showing off. <laughs> I don't think you should jog with it. It's just gonna hit the back of your neck. Quality wise, it is made out of like a breathable kind of workout material. It has a good stretch so you can stretch it around your neck and the clips are not as bad as I thought they were gonna be. So for all of those reasons, I'm gonna give this guy three Vivian heads. Acrylic storage rack wide, acrylic storage rack slim. This is made for your fridge, but I'm saying why can't we put this in the pantry, in the bathroom? Like if you have makeup, you can make a little shelf over the first layer of makeup. You know, we got a lot of stuff. And put all your like, all the skincare stuff. That's what I'm talking about. You see what I'm saying? It's not just for the fridge. Very impressed. You got a shelf. Look at, I mean, it could be for the fridge, but it could be in the cabinet. And this is sturt, it is small, but it is very, very well made. Excellent quality. It's not gonna fall apart. Do you love it? I absolutely love it. Okay, this is the wide. Let's move it over and do the slim to see how small it is. I love the acrylic look. I don't know why. I think that when it's acrylic like this, it doesn't look as cluttered because you can see through it. That makes sense. So when you put it in the bathroom, it looks really nice and open. That's how acrylic works in my head. These are so nice. I'm gonna have to go back and get more of these. Here's your slim one. You can combine two together. When I did that Dollar Tree video where I did the organizational stuff, you should subscribe because Bethany Frankel is trying to do Dollar Tree stuff and we can't let that happen. That's my job. So if you subscribe, it helps me get to the top of YouTube. Look how nice this is. Imagine if you put all your skincare products on here. I love it. In the fridge, they're gonna look cute too. And if you wanna get real crazy with it, do this. You have endless possibilities for the configuration of it. So I'm gonna give the wide shelf five Vivian heads and I'm gonna give the slim shelf five Vivian heads. Face lift up tape. You get 15 little tapes for $1.75. Firm and strong type that can be applied over makeup. I was afraid I wasn't gonna be able to do it because I have tons of makeup on. Transparent matte that will blend with your skin. It is unnoticeable. It will lift the problem areas around your eyes and your mouth by physical effects. Check Amazon to see how much face tape is. It's not cheap and I'm getting 15 of them for $1.75 and I can put it over makeup. I think that's really good. Okay, the instructions are interesting. Seems complicated, but we'll give it a shot. I mean, I got 15 tries. <laughs> I think there's gonna be a learning curve, but once you get it, you got it. That's what they look like. If you use tape to pull back your face, I need to hear about it in the comments down below. Okay, we'll look at this eye. I'm just gonna grab it from here and let me know if you see the tape. Oh no, ma'am, you do not see that tape. I gotta go. <laughs> 
I'm gonna lose that patch of hair right there, but just go like this. Cover it up. Look at my eye. Damn it. <laughs> the problem with this is that I'm gonna want a facelift now. <laughs> See, the problem is I'm gonna want a facelift or I'm gonna want that cat eye look. <laughs> look how good that looks. Changed my whole face. You can barely see it for a night out. This eye is everything, okay? I'm gonna go to the plastic surgeon and <laughs> be like, this is the look. Okay, now let's do the rest of the facelift. Let's lift the eye from up here. Okay, stretch. Did it lift it? It's kind of there, you see it? Oh, put a little powder, it's fine. Oh my God, why do I love it? Look at the difference in my face. You're gonna need 14 for every time you go out. I wanna pull my bottom. Oh my God, I'm gonna need an emergency facelift after this. Vivian, why are you doing this to yourself? Just be natural. It says behind the ear so we can pull the back of the face like this. So the pro tip is to put it down, right? And then pull like this. Put a little powder on it. Let's see if we can disguise it. Oh, you can still see them, right? Yeah, you can. This eye is everything. How else can I change my face and be just sad for the rest of the day? Can we pull the eye more? You did not tell me these were this good. Let's do a little bit of an extended eye lift. Hold it. How am I gonna recover from this? Somebody give me the phone number to your plastic surgeon. I'm going in for a face. <laughs> the tape is staying on, but I feel like you can still see it. Look at this. Now let's take it off. You see how good that is? Look at this. Oh, there went all my makeup. Oh no, it came right off. It did not hurt at all. Oh wait, is my eye always like that? <laughs> okay, maybe it didn't do anything. Maybe I've always had a cut eye. <laughs> Why does it look the same now? Oh, okay, that one hurt a little bit. I just don't know what occasion I would wear this where I could disguise it unless it's like a late night thing. And then you gotta remember where you put all the tape. If you can disguise it just a little bit, this thing is for real, for real, the real deal. And it's gonna work. Call off the plastic surgeons. I'm not getting a facelift, but I'm picking up more tape. So I'm gonna give the facelift tape four. Vivian heads. Sweat absorbing pads for your hats and visors. This is genius. When you're garage selling, mowing the yard, taking a hike on a cruise, not just for sweaty foreheads. No, makeup. Sometimes when you're wearing makeup, that rubs off on your hat. You don't want that. Now you got these inside the hat so nobody sees it. Nobody needs to know your business that you're a sweaty girl. Keep your hats clean. You don't have to wash them as often either. It's a pad for your forehead. It's genius. $1.75. I think there's two in here. Oh, and the padding looks very nice and thick. You know what else this is good for? When you get fresh Botox right here and you have your hat on like a silly girl because you forgot. You don't want that hat pushing down. Put a little cushion on there so the Botox don't move. I have here a visor or the inside of a cap. You guys know I love hats. This is everything I need. It's soft. Look how thick that is. That is some good cushion for your forehead. Oh, this is good. So you're not gonna have any marks on your forehead either. You know, have you ever seen somebody take off a hat and then their forehead is all red? Oh, this is gonna stop that. I'm gonna have to put them on all the hats now. See how long they are? I feel like that's too long. Actually, it's not. Look at that. You see it? Any activity out in the hot sun, put you one of these on. Sweat, and then when you get home, just tear it off. For kids, I'm telling you, a kid's hat, you can cut it in half. I mean, some kid have a big old head. You don't need instructions on installing this. All you do is peel back the little film. She might need instructions because she can't get it off. Sometimes I gotta buy two because I tear off the whole thing. <laughs> Has that happened to you? It's like you can never get right underneath there real good. Some tape there maybe? That worked, look. See, it lifted just enough for me. Ha ha, that's a life hack. Guess you should center it, start from the middle. Oh, I don't know. It might not work as good as I was thinking. Because I feel like it's not gonna lay flat. There is curvature to my hat. It's all wrinkly. It's not even. It's longer on one side than the other. Let me put it on. Now my hat's too tight. It feels amazing. It's gonna do the job by absorbing wet and funk coming off your forehead. I love the product. The installation process though. You might mess it up. But once it's on, it's good. It's really good. And, and your hat's not gonna move. <laughs> it's on there snug now. So I'm gonna give these guys four Vivian heads. Plastic covers. You know what these are good for? To cover up 
leftovers. Another way to use these when you're traveling. You know what I do? I put my shoes in these. I cover the bottom of my shoes with these because it has a little elastic band on it. So it goes onto your shoe beautifully. These I think are a little bit smaller for bowls like this. And then your nasty shoes ain't touching your clothes in your suitcase. That is a life hack that I've used for years. How many do we get for $1.75? 18. Are they small? For the kids shoes. Oh, these are really nice. For bowls, maybe have fruit, leftovers. That's a little bit big, but it still will work. Isn't this a great idea? Put a couple in the kitchen and a couple in the suitcase. Here we go, perfect. I love these so much. So that you don't have to use shrink wrap. This is just as easy and they're gonna stay nice and tight in there. Let's see if I can stack them. Maybe, I mean, I wouldn't recommend it. It could be done if it had to happen. You're getting 18 of them for $1.75. It's a steal and they're gonna be multi-purpose, multi-use. That's always a win. They're probably reusable too. As long as food doesn't touch them. I'm saying rinse them off. <laughs> That's so gross. If nothing's touching them, why not? Just rinse them off, put them out to dry and then reuse them again. At least one time, why not? So I'm gonna give the plastic film five Vivian heads. Anti-fog film. I think we all need this, right? I think it's for the car, but you guys know my rule number seven, multi-purpose, multi-use, right? Can we not use this in the bathroom? I have this little mirror in my shower and 90% of the time I can't use it. I've tried the little anti-fog wipes and all the tricks. None of them have worked for me. So what I was thinking was, <laughs> instead of putting this on the car, can I put this on my mirror? It doesn't fog up just right there in the center. Isn't that a great idea? So here's the reason that I think this dollar store is about to go. Because their prices now are $1.75 and up. Some stuff is $2, a lot of stuff is $3, $5, $4, $8. $1.50 was a lot at the time, but your products are so good. We're like, look the other way, just, just buy them. Now I'm like, uh, excuse me, this little haul cost me $50. That's not okay. So this better be multi-purpose, multi-use because I am only buying it for this. You're getting two, ooh, look at that. This is gonna work and they're pretty big, right? See it right there? I've been so disappointed with not being able to use the mirror when I'm in the shower that I would take this much. I'm happy with it because right now I get nothing. I have cleaned my surface. You wanna do that first. I guess for $1.75, this is not bad. And there's two stickers on here. You peel a little bit back like this, place it down so you don't get bubbles. Nope, it's not working. This side does say number one. I think you have to peel off, yes. Okay, that one's sticky now. I think that's the side that you put down. Now I think we got it. Are you guys watching? We can't do this again. Get all the bubbles out. The second sticker is to take off the blue. I don't know if you can see, but there's the little round circle in the middle. This is gonna work and I am so excited about it. If you need them for your car, you're gonna get two for $1.75. The quality seems really nice. Super easy to install. It's probably excellent for your car because that's the actual original use of it. I'm just using it off label. <laughs> if you're not following me on Instagram, you should follow me on Instagram because I'm gonna update you next time I take a shower because obviously right now, I don't know if it's gonna fog up or not. Where else can we use this? Is this not genius? I'm gonna give these guys four. Vivian heads. Four, because I don't know if it's gonna work yet. Bang curler. These are very trendy right now. And I happened to find it at Daiso for $1.75. Now it's only one. So it might be a lot if you have to do the whole setup. But have you seen the girls who are doing the roller around their face for the volume? Well, Daiso is gonna sell you one for your bangs. <laughs> this is silly. What would grandma say if she saw these kind of rollers? Look at this. To me, it's new. So I'm gonna call it revolutionary, but this might have been around forever. But the girls on the internet, they're putting it around like this all the way around. So let's take my hair down. I bet that's gonna work. Oh, I need more of these. Curl your hair and then you leave them in this. Grandma would kill for these. Look how nice. They're not even getting like tangly or anything. I think if my bangs were not that long, it would work beautifully. Now, if you have long bangs, this is not gonna work for you, but either way, I absolutely love it. Now I gotta figure out how to use it with my length of hair. The quality of it is pretty impressive as well. I love how it's made. They clip closed really nicely. They're not gonna pull or tug on your hair, but it's firm enough to keep it closed. It's definitely a winner for the right length of hair. I think this model has the right length. Look at that. You see what I'm saying? If you have long hair, it's not gonna work as good, but for short haired girls all day and easy to take off, look. So I'm gonna give the bang curler scissors for Vivian heads and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.